Good morning, everybody. It's Monday, and I am over the moon, excited about this week. It's going to be a really, really good one, so I figured I'd put the moon behind me. Anyway, um, this was not a planned video. Um, just got a call from a client who we're like literally one day, the docs are in, titles balancing with the lender, everything's done, refi, VA, awesome deal, awesome rate. I mean, it couldn't be better. And um, the client called me and said, hey, um, Quicken just called and said, uh, just sent me an email saying that um, that that payoff that was requested, which is an alert to Quicken that he's refinancing with someone else. Um, they wrote up this whole loan estimate that looked super official. It was like, it looked real. I would have thought it was real. In fact, at first I did. And then I sat and I thought about it. They were offering him, I think it was a quarter, quarter of a point less, which in the great scheme of things really wasn't that much more. They were charging him $395, whereas ours is giving him back some. Um, but the way that they structured the loan estimate on paper looked like they weren't charging anything, but they were, it was bizarre. And this is the most amazing part. You ready? They gave him a rate and locked him. And I said, well, did you ask them to lock you? And he said, no, they just locked it. And I thought, well, wait a minute. And then my next question was, well, did they run your credit? No, they didn't. So how did they give you a rate and lock you without knowing what your credit score is? Turns out they didn't run credit, they just locked in and it was an advertisement. I mean, so he's all freaked out now and um, wondering if he should switch and move and, and I don't know guys, I just be really careful, watch your mail, watch your email. Um, you, Right now, there's so many, I mean, obviously, all these rates are so low and everybody's talking about refinancing. And I just, just be really careful because um, the fees are there, I promise you. I mean, we all have fees. There's, you know, some fees are higher than others, but there's some deceptive marketing practices that I personally don't agree with. I'd rather be straight and narrow, straight through the front door as my fabulous processor grin says I go straight through the front door um, but it's just it, it's crappy so now he's all confused and um, it you know I'm trying to, to have a show him and you know at the end of the day it's whatever's best for him absolutely unequivocally but this isn't best for him and it's not honest so just thought I'd throw it out there because that's what I'm dealing with Monday morning um, but you know it's part of the Part, part of how it goes. Just be really careful. And if you ever have a question about advertisements that you get or um, estimates that you get, make sure that you, I mean, hey, reach out to me. I'll help. Even if, even if it's a, you know, you stay with the company that you're with. Um, I just, it's important to me that people understand what they're signing, first of all, what they're getting into, and that there are some, um, you know, greedy people out there, maybe companies. Anyway, Go with a broker, they're better. Just wanted to share that super, super quick. As you can see, not a prepared video, just uh, <laughs> just public service announcement. So I hope you have a great week. Um, I know there's lots of environmental issues going on, political issues going on, and there's a lot of angst going on. So just make sure you take a deep breath and, and make sure that you control your environment as much, much as you can, your mental environment. I sure try. So bye, everybody. I'll talk to you soon.